Hey guys, welcome back to a new video. So Battlefield 2042 is finally done. We will be getting no more content. And as of me writing the script, they posted yesterday, they said, but well, we enjoyed and are proud of creating the seasons for additional content for Battlefield 2042. It is now necessary for us to turn from the present to the future. What this ultimately means is that season 7 will serve as the final season for Battlefield 2042. After season 7 concludes, we will continue to support the game with new in-game challenges, events, modes and of course ongoing maintenance, but we are moving away from delivering official seasons. So with this, the game is done and the next time we will see new content then in terms of a new Battlefield will be with Battlefield 2025 probably releasing around October, November next year. And even though they stayed, they will continue to support the game with new game challenges, events, modes, and of course, ongoing maintenance. This probably basically means they will recycle all game modes we played a hundred times. They will probably publish a few more skins in the shop, but that's basically it. So with this, Battlefield 2042 is officially done. I think that's not surprising for a lot of people. And I think the only thing a lot of people might be surprised by is that they ended it on season seven. I think a lot of us expected at least a season 8 so they could say they technically supported the game for a whole two years instead of one year and three seasons. But yeah, the game is done. They just published this yesterday. We will be getting no content, no new maps, no new guns probably. I still hope they like bring in the guns from Portal and the gun and the maps from Portal. But I'm not quite sure if they will actually do it since this would require them to assert attachments and balance and do some more work. And since we know this, they don't really like to work, at least from <laughs> what I have seen so far. And yeah, with this, they basically leave us with season seven. The next content we will be getting will be Stadium, the new LMG and the new Bomber in like a few weeks from now. Okay, so I'm just gonna add this in here since this update just dropped when I was already done with this video and uploaded it. So I have to upload it again, but they dropped the spring roadmap. So on April 16th we will get update 7.1 with a new time limited event Crimson Front. Hopefully there are some visual record changes but I will go over the patch notes when they drop. On April 30th we will finally get the stadium map and in mid-May we will will get update 7.2 with the bomber and a new LMG. So they don't come with the stadium. So we'll only get probably a playlist update with sta where stadium will be in. And then May until June, we will get a future strike event or a new time limited event. But yeah, just want to add this in here. I still hope they actually do some more changes to the visual recall because some guns are unusable. I hope they don't leave the game in the state that it is currently. And so now is the question, what are we supposed to do with the game? Because or at least for like content creators. I heard that Anders already said on Twitter that he's going to probably take like a four months vacation. But I'm now asking myself, what am I supposed to do really with the game? I mean, there's still a bit of content I can make. There's still some guns I want to do weapon guides on and also with the stadium drop, a new map and stuff. But I think in like two months, maybe three months from now, there's nothing to do with the game anymore. I mean, nobody wants to see me running redacted 24 seven dropping high kill game they get boring after a while so yeah i probably now need to switch up my content a bit to other games and here i would like to have a bit of your help actually guys because i don't really know what i'm supposed to play now because let's face it the next thing we have close to battlefield where battle bit but this game is kind of dead now because the devs are like the devs at dice where they just want to do their own thing even though nobody likes it then we have like call of duty but with warzone but i don't really want to spend 60 bucks on mono warfare 3 just to level up the guns to even have a chance in warzone and as for other games i don't know there's like apex Legends, Fortnite, PUBG and stuff like this but I don't really enjoy Battle Royales that much. The only other game I could really think about playing would actually be Valorant because a friend of mine wants to play it with me but here's the thing with Valorant there really isn't much you can do content wise like the game is really nice to stream but when it comes to YouTube other than a lot of people doing coaching stuff for this so uploading like a montage where they want to have a lot of people like once a week or once a month there really isn't a lot of content I can do for the game. And then the only other thing I could think of would be Overwatch, since I like playing Overwatch with friends. But there's also the question, like most people when they watch Overwatch probably want to see Overwatch ranked. 
And I played a bit of ranked in Overwatch, but I don't think I have the mental capacity to actually grind Overwatch ranked because the game is just cancer. So yeah, what am I supposed to do now? Maybe I drop it down to like one Battlefield video a week? Then maybe I can do it for like 17 months, but this would be boring for you guys. So yeah, if you have any like tips or examples of what I could do, <laughs> it would be very helpful actually, because I just... I don't have a clue with them shutting down the game. I mean, I expected it to come and I expected it that we get at least like a season 8 so that we can at least last until like October, November this year. And then we have like two or three months of downtime where you can somehow make some content to get over it. And then next year they probably start teasing like the next Battlefield so you can make content or this and somehow it works out but with them shutting basically the game down now and only adding in some challenges and new skins probably there really isn't anything to do on this game anymore so yeah please let me know down in the comments below what other content you would like to see or what i am supposed to do now and with this Battlefield 2042 is officially over some people are probably happy, some other people are like, well, the game just got a bit better besides the visual recoil, but with like season 6 with the redacted map and even season 7 is not that bad, even though it's boring. But yeah, game is finally over now. Now we are waiting for the next battlefield. I have no clue what I'm supposed to upload now. And yeah, thank you so much for watching until the end and I will see you in the next one.